So to set a cue point on our pad, we're just gonna press one of the pads and then you used to have to get to the right beat where these lines are and then set it manually. But now there's a new feature. So if you hold in these pads, it's gonna snap to a beat. So let me just raise the BPM so it's a little bit easier to see. So with the song playing, if I just tap a cue point, you see how that cue point was set in the middle, which is not really somewhere where you would want a cue point. But now if you hold in the cue point, hold in the pad, and then if we hold it in, you could see it move. So I'm going to set this cue point in the middle. Cue point's right there. But if you hold it in when you do it, so you're going to press it and then keep holding it in to move it. This is really tricky. Uh, when I wanted to make this video, I had to try a bunch of times, but the trick is you have to do it in the same press. So we're gonna set it over here, push it in to set it, and then hold it in and you could see it jump. This makes it really easy to set these cue points while the track is going so you could do DJ tricks and organize your tracks while it's actually playing. So with the song playing, we're going to press it and then hold it and then you'll see it move. Really cool new feature makes setting cue points on the fly a lot easier and a lot more fun and a lot less stressful.